So the other day, YouTube rolled out an update to their user interface where they added hints of pink to areas that were previously just red. One noticeable change is in the progress bar when watching a video. As the video progresses, the bar shifts from red to pink. Personally, I find this off-putting and out of place, so in this video, I'll show you how to change it back to just red. It's a simple process and works on pretty much any browser. I'm using Firefox, but I've also tested this on Chromium-based browsers like Chrome and Brave. The first step is to download the Stylebot extension. I'll leave links in the description below to where you can install the Stylebot extension for both Chrome and Firefox. Once you've installed and enabled Stylebot, go to any YouTube video. The one you are currently watching will work just fine. Now let's open up the Stylebot extension. In Firefox, click the puzzle piece icon in the top right hand corner to view all of our extensions, then select Stylebot. A box will pop up and just click Open Stylebot, and it will appear on the right side of your screen. Next click on the Code tab at the bottom and paste the code that I've provided in the description below. As you can see, the progress bar immediately changes back to red. If I temporarily remove the code, the pink color returns. So I'm just going to re-enter the code back into Stylebot. You can click the X button to close out of Stylebot. This fix also applies to the progress bar on video previews, like the ones that you see on the YouTube homepage. Even if I refresh the page, close YouTube, or even close out of my browser entirely, the styles that we added with Stylebot will remain. The only thing I can change is the YouTube logo, which now has a pinkish hue to it, as well as the bit of pink around the channel icon that indicates when a channel is live. However, these aren't a huge deal in my opinion and they're not super noticeable. Anyways, that's all I have for this tutorial. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.